Senator Simons. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. My question is for the government representative. NAV Canada, the private monopoly that's responsible for Canada's air traffic control system, is facing catastrophic financial shortfalls due to the impact of COVID-19 on its usual revenues. And as a result, NAV Canada is now carrying out service reviews at six Canadian airports, Windsor, Sault Ste. Marie, Regina, Fort McMurray, Prince George, and Whitehorse, which could lead to the closure of air traffic control towers at all or some of those airports. With the understanding that NAV Canada is a private company, can you tell us what steps your government is taking to ensure the safety and sustainability of the Whitehorse, Prince George, Fort McMurray, Regina, Sault Ste. Marie, and Windsor airports? Senator Gold. Uh, thank you for your question and for raising the very, very challenging and disturbing circumstances under which not only regional airports, but the airline industries generally face. Uh, as, a, uh, as the Minister of Finance uh, has uh, stated on a number of occasions, the government uh, is considering more targeted and specific measures that to, to assist uh, certain sectors of the economy. Uh, and uh, I expect that the details of those uh, plans, which are being developed along with stakeholders and all interested parties, uh, will be released uh, when they are uh, done. Senator Simons, do you wish to ask a supplementary? Yes, Mr. Speaker. Uh, give this question is also for the government representative. Given NAV Canada's revenue crisis, what steps is the government taking to ensure the sustainability of NAV Canada and, in turn, the safety and the sovereignty of Canadian airspace? Senator Gold. <clears throat> This government has taken many steps with regard to securing uh, the sovereignty of our airspace, uh, including its partnership uh, with others in NORAD and in other initiatives. But with regard to your question, uh, again, I repeat, the government is considering specific and more targeted measures to deal with sectors of our economy uh, that were especially hard hit uh, and, and uh, uh, in consultation with, not, with, with all stakeholders. Um, will be uh, developing its plans, and when they are ready, will be announced. Thank you. 